Hello again fellow guardians, today I have my non night 4 method of crushing the devil's lair strike on earth, I'm playing on the level 8 strike for the said environment, however this way works the same on vanguard rock and etc. For this video my pick out of the armor is red death, sword breaker, ice breaker and hunger of crota because destiny thinks the time too good to own a g -Hall. I use this loadout because 1, they are all really badass, and 2, because I just got red death and need to upgrade it like well have you seen that red death perk that heals you after every kill like hell yes I'm gonna have that. For this part as it is a normal strike and not nightfall you can run freely like me. Otherwise I suggest hiding near the tank at the far right of the room from when you walk in, as there is cover, and enemies don't go down there long. Devil's Lair is a great map for many bounties such as the Walking Tall Bounty which requires you to complete a strike without dying. This strike is so easy, so I prefer this map for that bounty. The map is so easy in fact, that if you die you should dismantle your g -horn as punishment. That of course applies to all people under level 20, being lenient that is. method I find is this sniping spot to the far left of the area. It is good because you're out of the walker's range and enemies don't spawn there. Firstly shoot the glowing yellow sweet spots on the legs with a long range sniper such as icebreaker because otherwise this garden of Eden safe zone is useless once he buckles down shoot at the neck, then rinse and repeat until dead. Epic's Prime himself is fairly simple, just shoot at his eye for criticals, blinded fool. Subscribe Ashfixler.